<laughs> to me, that's not ethical. <laughs> oh, oh, you mean the return thing? Yeah, I mean, it's not ethical, sure. I mean, sure, ethics. We, we got that, right? I mean, it's not like I put in Windows 7. You want to talk about ethics. Like, it's not... I'm not saying this is what I did, but I mean, it's not like I installed Windows 7 on my PC and then went and found a free upgrade to, for Windows 10 which you're only allowed to accept that upgrade if you use the accessibility features of Windows 10, if you rely on them. Not if you use them, but if you rely on them. You're not supposed to do that. I'm not saying that's what I did. But if we're talking about ethics, then, you know, there are some people out there who would be like, oh, well, I could just go buy Windows 7 off eBay, a, uh, an OEM code for Windows 7 off eBay, and I can go install Windows 7, and then I can go get that free Windows 10 upgrade, and if I don't like Windows 10, it will let me, for free, downgrade back to Windows 7. That, I mean, I'm just saying, there's some unethical people who could do that, not me. I didn't do that. Why would I ever do such a thing? Just saying that there are people that would do that. <laughs> Windows 10 is a downgrade, though. <laughs> it's true. It really is. I, I've been having... I like... I like the ease of Windows 10 so far. So, like, I used to work with Windows 10, right? I used to actually work with Windows 10 back when I did product testing, you know, a couple years ago. I guess now it's been a couple years. Uh, I was there before Windows 10, the free upgrade, was given to people. I was there before Windows 10 was even in use. And, boy... There was not, it was not even an operating system. Like, I'm telling you, that, that shit was baroque. That shit was broke. Just like everybody who ever talks about Windows 10 prior to Windows 10, it was broke. Now, I'm using Windows 10, it is a lot less broke. I mean, a ton less broke. I know a lot of people were complaining pretty much the same complaints when it actually came out for free and everybody could upgrade. It was still largely broke and people were just upset about that shit. Personally speaking, it was super broke that I didn't even, I never even gave a second thought to the free upgrade. Never. Never, never, ever. Then I got this PC. It's been like two, three years or something since I worked on it. And I was like, you know what? I hear people say it's better. I have it now. I used it. I upgraded from it. I've been, I'm using Windows 10 right now. And it is, it's a lot better than I remember using it a while ago. It's a lot better. But, there is some weird-ass janky shit that goes on with this Windows. And I'm, I'm saying, like, programs will not load sometimes. Zoom Player, which is my so far preferred video player, it will not load up sometimes. It just flat out won't load up. It just crashes. And I, I don't know why in the world that is. I've had that with nothing else. The internet... Something goes on with my home group because I got multiple computers, right? And I, I do I do the home group thing so they can all see each other, they can all talk to each other and all that shit. And I can see I can see files on other computers in, in the home. That thing will just randomly not work. I will restart the machine, I will go try and access some shit on my PC upstairs from down here. Will not work. Just flat out won't it won't see it. It doesn't know what the fuck it is. And that's through the home group. If I go through like, some other method of trying to get through it? Uh, it I, I can't even remember, like, what, what would it be? There's, there's two of these things. There's network, and then there's home group. If I choose network and go look at my PC upstairs, it will work. But if I use the home group, it won't work. It's literally the same thing, but it won't work. It's the, and then I'll restart the machine, and then sometimes it will work. It's the weirdest thing on the planet. I've never heard or seen anything like that before in my life. And I'm pretty sure that's Windows 10. <laughs> so, like... I don't know how I feel about Windows 10 right now. So far, it's been okay. Like, the ease in which I, like, upgraded everything, it's actually kind of cool. I gotta, I gotta give... <laughs> I have to give some, some bonus to that a little bit. Which 